China's J-10C stealth fighter jet enters combat duty, here is what it is capable of. China's new indigenously developed multi-role stealth fighter jet J-10C, capable of striking precisely both land and maritime targets, were put into active combat duty today, the military said. The third-generation supersonic fighter jets are equipped with an advanced avionics system and multiple advanced armament, making it capable of precisely striking both land and maritime targets within medium and close range, the People's Liberation Army Air Force PLOF, said in a statement. China had in February commissioned its latest J-20 stealth fighter into its Air Force's combat service. The J-20 is China's fourth-generation medium and long-range fighter jet. The Chinese supersonic fighter jet had made its debut in July last year, when the PLA marked its 90th anniversary, at Zurahi military training base in Inner Mongolia Autonomous Region. The fighter will enrich the Air Force's offensive and defensive system and improve its capability to fulfill duties and missions, the statement said. Shen Jinki, a spokesperson for the PLOF, said that the Air Force will advance training and war readiness, and sharpen its striking, defensive, and air delivery capabilities. It will also firmly safeguard China's airspace security and national strategic interests in the new era, Shen was quoted as saying by the state-run Xinhua news agency. Taiwan state-owned news agency The Central News Agency CNA, had earlier reported that the J-10C is more streamlined than the J-10B to reduce drag. Hong Kong military analyst Lung Kwok Lung said that the J-10C has stealth capabilities entirely different from existing stealth warplanes. The J-10C fuselage absorbs radar waves and weakens its signals, as a result, the waves do not bounce back to the radar, making the plane stealth, the state-run Global Times said quoting the CNA report today. It is a brand new stealth technology, it said. The news of induction of the new warplane came at a time when Chinese military held its biggest ever military exercises and parade in the disputed South China Sea last week. The naval hardware seen at the parade, inspected by Chinese President Xi Jinping, showcased achievements made by the People's Liberation Army Navy, including nuclear submarines in its modernization drive, military observers said. A researcher at the PLA Naval Military Studies Research Institute, Senior Captain CAO Wei Dong said that the Navy received a large number of new weapons with advanced capabilities over the past five years and new hardware features a higher information capability and optimized joint operation system and thus can better carry out sophisticated joint operations. Kui Yuliang, editor-in-chief of Modern Ships magazine, said the Navy showed almost all of its new hardware delivered during the past 10 years. It is now capable of conducting every naval operation, from strategic strike to amphibious assault, he said. The nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarines involved in the parade are of the latest generation and have many improvements compared with their predecessors. The new nuclear-powered attack submarines are reportedly capable of launching cruise missiles, he said. Wu Pison, a defense industry analyst in Beijing, said the PLA Navy has been steadily and rapidly catching up with the U.S. Navy in terms of technological and operational capabilities of its hardware.